been here before. here before and you've been right here with me. Every act of creation, no matter how solitary, once it's put out into the world, is ultimately a collaboration. In this case, between me and you. And the thing is, when we publish the video or print the words on the page, we have no idea who's going to be on the other side. If anyone's going to be on the other side, it's, it's ultimately a leap of faith. someone that's made a thing they love, the question they're always asking, no matter what words come out of their mouth is, how did you do that? How did you make that thing that I love? And then of course, by extension, they're asking, how can I make a thing that I love? And that's the tough question. The answer that I always give my students is to read a lot and write a lot. If you're not a writer, you can substitute read for watch or listen or observe or whatever it is that would be pertinent as a verb to what you want to do. I mean, ultimately it's about consuming a lot of what you want to make and then making a lot of what you want to make. Ira Glass in an in, uh, interview ages and ages ago says that you're gonna you're gonna know what you like long before you can make what you like. That's a paraphrase but that's basically what he's saying. Your tastes develop long before your ability to act on those tastes, to create based on those tastes. if I'm saying anything at all. That maybe making a video every day, every day for one year, is a pretty good way at figuring out how to make videos. Seasons of Love, Jonathan Larson tells us that a year is made up of 525,600 minutes. He probably tells us more than he needs to. It's a good song, but it's a bit repetitive. And the question in the song, the question that, uh, that the singers ask over and over again is, how do you measure a year? They say to measure it in love, I will measure it in videos. I mean, I did 365 videos. This is the 365th video of my 40th year. And I guess, you know, my my friend Brandon ended his with, uh, with a bit of a rock concert and uh, I'm, I don't have any, uh, well, I mean, I can sing, but I can't play any instruments. Um, so I'm ending my videos with 
a bit of, uh, I was going to say profundity. I don't know if that's actually the word, profoundness. But I like profundity. I don't, I, even if that's not the word, I'm going to go with it. Profundity, profundity, now, deep insider thought. I was right. I think that's a wrap. <laughs> I keep trying to think of some something grand to end on, but um, I don't know. When I try to be grand, it usually ends badly. You know, maybe uh, maybe one time out of ten, two times out of ten. What was that rule I told Brandon? From, uh, from Jonathan Mann, two times out of 10. Two times out of 10, maybe. One time out, I don't know. Every once in a while I manage to uh, get it right. But uh, I don't know what's next. I really don't. Um, not doing daily videos for a while. Uh, maybe weekly, maybe monthly. Gotta figure it out. But um, I thank you for uh, coming on this journey with me. I didn't think I'd make it. I've done 365 day projects before for photos. Uh, I've done one where I, I get the song every day to kind of, you know, say what was going on in my life. But uh, 365 videos, I thought maybe I'll, I'll be able to do it. Here I am, it's done. So uh, with that, I will, I will sign off and tell you that my name is E. Christopher Clark. I write stories about fractured families. Must go, must gone, must gone, wrong, wrong, must gone wrong. Memories is time machines. If you like what I do, you can uh, support me at patreon.com slash eChristopherClark. You can check out everything I'm doing at clarkwoods.com. And I will catch you, where I always used to say it, always used to end my, 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 my stuff by saying, I will catch you on the flip side. I guess I'm done. I think I'm done.